happy Super Bowl, or as I call it, buy extra hand sanitizer day. That's right. It's Super Bowl time. Most people are focused on the Super Bowl. We're focused on the coronavirus and other illnesses or the Wuhan Feiyan. We live near San Jose. All hand sanitizers, gloves, masks, bleach is sold out. It's sold out here. It's going to be sold out where you are. Go enjoy the Super Bowl. Get some buffalo wings. See if there are uh, any hand sanitizer or bleach left where you are. Where we are, there is none. Because there's one case within 300 miles. You're going to be sold out very, very soon. Go now. Buy hand sanitizer. Buy bleach. Bleach wipes. Buy masks. Face masks. Things like that. Remember, anything you normally need, you're not going to be able to get it. So if something you need for two weeks, two weeks, you better stock up. You better stock up now. Don't do it tomorrow. Don't do it the next day. Now, while everyone's thinking about the Super Bowl. This is super important. <laughs> it's super important to do that. Even if you're in Ohio, even if you're in Florida, Texas, wherever you are, go check it out. I asked a couple of my friends. They went to look, and sure enough, they were sold out too. Or they found the last ones. Be the ones who find the last ones. Because right now what we know about the coronavirus, virus, Wuhan, Feiyan, if you get it, there's a 1 in 50 chance that, that you'll die. Normally, it's a 1 in like 10,000 chance if you get the flu. Normally 1 in 10,000. But now it's only 1 in 50. And if you're on the edges, if you're older, if you're sick, if you're young, it's even more. So regular, strong person, one, only 1 in 50 is going to going to die from this but it's going to affect if you if you have diabetes it's going to be harder to get things if you have a lung condition if you have a cough a normal cough people are going to think you're contagious they're going to treat you differently you must react you must do it now go now to the store and buy hand sanitizer if you can find it i bet you won't comment <laughs> below if you went there and it was all gone no matter where you are now is the time do not wait until tomorrow yeah. So I've been hearing lots of stories from inside Wuhan. I survived SARS. I was in SARS in 2003. I was there in Beijing. My wife's family is from Wuhan, and half of them are still living there. They're quarantined. They're in there. There's lots of sad, sad stories because you... If they think you have the disease, they take you away, obviously quarantine, but you... The people who perish, they don't get to say goodbye to their families, which is sad. So be on good terms. Use this as a chance to connect, reconnect with people. And do not wait. Get Perel, whatever brand you like. It doesn't matter. But people say soap and water is almost as good or rubbing alcohol. Rubbing alcohol is good, too. And anyone who was sick, if they came within two meters of you, then there's a chance you got the disease. And remember, it's not just this disease. So any disease you're going to get right now, people are going to treat you differently. So you do not want the common cold. You do not want the common flu. People are going to overreact, overreact. So you have to stay, stay. don't do this, what I just did. Oh, Don't touch your face. <laughs> Try to play a game, make it a game. The don't touch your face game. How many times did I almost touch my face? Because that's the biggest thing. I even wear gloves. You know, gloves can help. But keep your hands clean. Go to the store. Super Bowl Sunday. Super sanitizing day Sunday. Let's clean it up. All right, America. All right, the world. Everybody. All right, China. Wuhan Jayo. Wuhan Jayo. Sanitizer Jayo. Dojayo.